Got to get him in. He doesn't like it. Oh my god, it's a monster. Guys, I want a monster. Using this float with a rattle. Pretty short leader because there's a whole lot of snags. I lose more fish to snags over here than I do catch fish, but I'm gonna go ahead and cast it right under these pillars. It's a good spot. The deepest spot in this river, at least that I know of over here, is on this far bank. It's about eight to 10 feet, I'd say. I went kayaking and I kind of did some death checking the other day. So we'll go ahead and toss this guy out. You know, like they say, best spot for flatheads, structure. Current's pretty heavy today. Let's see what we can do. Got the same rig on this one, except I got different weight. About to just take this bluegill sunfish, whatever. I think it's a hybrid. And I'm gonna toss him pretty shallow. Probably just about five or six feet off the bank. Cause this water is so high. And a lot of times what I found, at least on this river, when the water gets real high like this, uh, these fish, these catfish at least, they like to come up to the bank and feed. Not sure why. I don't know if this heavy water pushes the bait fish out. Uh, not sure, but I had good luck the other night doing it like this. So let's hope. For my last pull, I'm gonna go ahead and use my trusty whisker seeker knife, cut this bluegill up. And then I'm going to toss it right out there. All right. Seven hours later. Oh, yeah. Fish on. Oh, man. This feels big. Well, this feels like it could be a big one, guys. I might actually have a good fish on. I gotta keep him up. Do not want him to get snagged. Oh yeah, this is a good one. Oh my goodness, guys. Heart's beating. Back off the drag a little. This is a big fish. Oh, whatever this is, please don't come off. Oh my God. Oh my God. Got to get him in. He doesn't like it. Oh my God, it's a monster. Guys, I want a monster. Where's my net? I can't even go get it right now. No way. Oh, he's just peeling drag. He is peeling the drag. Please don't come off. I haven't even seen him yet. I'm gonna get him over here. He is not happy. Oh yes. Guys, monster, monster. Is this gonna be a PB? I gotta get him. Heart is racing. Oh my God. Dude. Oh my God, no way. I gotta, I gotta grip this fish. I'm not losing him, I just took a hook to the hand. I don't give a shit. Oh my God. Oh my God. Well, you guys, 
I don't know how good you can see it's kind of dark but we finally got ourselves a good flathead for the year you know he's not as he doesn't weigh as much as I thought he did when I first pulled him out of the water probably because I've only caught a couple decent ones in my life but I thought he was 20 25 could have been 30 he was about 17 pounds but for the river I'm fishing this is a really 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 big fish uh, I come out here every night spend hours and hours fish different spots and the biggest I've ever caught was 26 that video is in my channel if you guys want to take a look back it's one of the first videos I did but uh, yeah it's rare you catch a big fish like this out of this river it's a small river it's almost like a creek I know they're in here I'm trying to get a 30 maybe a 40 this year but uh, we're just getting started I'm gonna go ahead take a picture of this guy and then I'm gonna get a release on him hopefully this video does it justice not a monster fish by any means but it's a it's a big fish all right you guys had him out for a while got some good pictures some good video it's time to let this big old flatty go it's the biggest one I've got this year third biggest one I've caught in my life got a like I said 26 last year got about a 20 and then I got a couple 15s this one's right at 17 there it goes all right what a good night I know a lot of you guys probably some of you guys watching this video you guys are like Jeremy that's not a big fish we catch 40 pounders 50 pounders 60 pounders but uh I'm happy I'm really happy get some more.